Hello everyone and welcome back to TechSim, the YouTube channel where technology is simplified. In today's video, I'm going to be explaining exactly why you need to buy a graphics card in 2020 heading into 2021. Make sure you stick around until the end of the video as I'll be sharing some crucial information which may prolong the life of your computer or save it from terminal damage. Also, we are genuinely closing in on 200 subscribers, so if you wouldn't mind subscribing with notifications on, it would really go a long way. But with that being said, let's get into the video. The demand for a more realistic looking gaming experience is increasing by the day, and with all this rise in the quality and functionality of video games, it means that there is a need for advanced hardware acceleration components in order to create the gaming experience you are truly looking for. By advanced hardware acceleration components, I essentially mean a graphics card. If you don't know what a graphics card is, I would highly recommend watching my video on it by clicking the pop-up banner. But in short, a graphics card is like an additional component that boosts your PC performance. It frees up the memory in your computer allowing it to run other tasks comfortably. It contains its own GPU, RAM and chipset that takes the load from your primary CPU and RAM and directly boosts the performance of your PC. This is definitely one of the main reasons to get a graphics card, but not only this, the most important reason is because if you play an FPS game without a graphics card, you'll be using what's called integrated graphics, which isn't great for the health of your CPU. As mentioned a minute ago, using integrated graphics will use a lot of your CPU power, so not only will it severely slow down your computer, but it will put a lot of strain on your CPU, which isn't good as it will ultimately reduce the lifespan of your processor and potentially overheat your computer, leading to other internal components being damaged as well. But don't get me wrong, playing low load games like Roblox and Minecraft will not affect your computer in a negative way, but if you want to play games like Call of Duty, Cyberpunk and other high load games, buying a graphics card is definitely a very good idea. That's about it for this video, but if you enjoyed it or found it helpful, make sure you like and subscribe. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next one.